all right hey guys welcome back to the minecraft fnaf multiplayer survival series and uh yeah we are back for part five so in the last episode we went on a wild journey into the jungle and um and this dude died and then we got a bunch of waifu plushies and uh oh and, yeah and, guys, oh and guys, also guys. and off camera someone stole his pants so you had to get yeah I, I, glitch trap he stole my pants i don't know why but yeah, yeah. but and then, before we and do then, anything else i have to show you my uh plushy collection that's been increased all right so i got i got two I'm, i've i consider them two different like you know stages i suppose you could say so first off you got the normal plushy so you got toy bonnie and healthy right they're, they're yeah pretty cool right? then now what i would consider the waifu plushies because i know uh, show me your waifu plushie what waifu plushies have you got i got in here we got i got toy thicka and i got yeah, the nice. blora waifu nice and then okay. i guess also scrap baby too i guess she also counts as a waifu. yeah well I'm, I'm coming here anyway and i got Vanny and Scrap Baby, so nice. I, and then you got you actually got two Vannies, but then you gifted one to me, so thank you for exactly. the gift, Senpai. No problem, but wait, hold on a second. I called Scrap Baby a waifu, but isn't she my? All right. So, anyways, um, we got another challenge today. Please, I I need, I need to get my mind off that. Please tell me the challenge right now. Alright, so for the challenge, and hopefully you can actually win this challenge for once, because so far I think you've lost every single one. Uh... I don't um, know. I, I'd say... I, I, wait, what was the last... I mean, I, well, the last one wasn't really a challenge. Yeah, last, last we didn't do a challenge last time. Yeah. Well, yeah. I, I'd say I, I'm, I'm gonna... Con I'm, I mean, like, I, like, by the time we're recording this, only, like, episode one for both of us is out, so yeah, we're a little behind. It's little probably little actually no, we're a little yeah. ahead. You should say. Yeah, a little ahead, a little ahead. So I'm gonna, I'm just gonna assume I won the first one because I think my music box was excellent, and um, I'm only saying that because uh, you, you pretty sure you've won all the other ones. So uh, yeah, yeah, I'll but... give you that point. I'll give you that one. Yeah. All right. Cool. Yeah. So, so hopefully, I've I'm pretty sure. Wait, we've moving. only we've only done two challenges. We've did the house challenge and then the pl the first plushie challenge. So we both yeah, have we... one point. Well, that's that's. Uh... What? Uh. Uh. I think someone's stalking us. Hey, hey, well, why are you here? Oh, oh, hey, oh right. you hurt his feelings. Oh. <laughs> you made him run away. He's like, I'm gonna go pop this hill. I, I just, I just wanted to know well, why, why is he here? I'm gonna confront him. Why are you here? What do you want? Well, why, why, hey, hey, this is a neighborhood watch area. What? Where did he come from? What the heck? I, he started punching me, and it wasn't nice. Oh my Thank gosh, that was, was uncivilized. Alright, so anyways guys, also something else we should inform you guys on is now we are in version 1.1 .1 of the mod. So now, the beds are fixed! Yay! <laughs> so if you go to sleep, you can sleep and set your spawn. And then, um, you get spookums. So, yeah. Oh. Wait, what was that? What was Don't worry spookums? about it. Just... Oh, oh, oh my goodness, it's so scary. Oh my I know, goodness. I, I know, spooky, spooky, ah. spooky moment. Ah, oh, oh, oh no. Oh, Alright, no. so anyways, enough Here. distractions. I, do you yes. think it's about time to start? I believe so. Alright guys, so for today's challenge for episode number 5, I think it's about time we start building our first pizzerias. So me yeah, and Junkie yeah, are going yeah, to yeah. Uh, build our own pizzerias, and uh, we're going to have an hour to build. And, um, and then we're going to review each other's at the end, and um, you guys get to decide which one's the best. So yeah, what are you doing? I'm punching the floor with my knife. Nice! Challenge time, challenge time, it's time for the challenge. So are you ready to go build your own unique pizzeria? Yes, and so, I think so, I'm... Right, yeah, cool, yeah. Alright, so we do have some rules for this. So for the rules is, number one, you cannot just go to a pizzeria location and claim it as your own. I hear Golden Freddy, you should get inside. I, I don't want us to die at the start. Um, where is he at? Oh my gosh, why is there always a Golden Freddy? Mate, okay, well, me. we're just going to ignore him. So we do have some, some rules for this. So rule number one, you can't just go find a pizzeria that's already built up. You have to build your own pizzeria. Um, but then for our pizzeria, there are going to be some requirements. Oh yeah, Golden Freddy's outside. Um, <laughs> uh, so for our pizzeria, we have to have at least a show stage, a security office, and a prize corner. So oh. that's that what we must have. He oh. can teleport inside the house, right? I mean, he can. But he won't, right? I don't know. Where'd he go? He teleported over here somewhere. 
Okay, he's gone. Let's just not worry about it. Um, yeah. all right. Uh, Golden Freddy is stalking us right now. See, this is what happens if you don't leave a like. Golden Freddy's gonna teleport exactly. to your house. Exactly. And you, if you watch the rest of the episodes, which hopefully you have, otherwise, if you haven't, then that's not cool. Um, and you, you know how lovely with it, uh, with the Golden Freddy and normal Golden Freddy are. To you know, they're so nice. They're such nice. Yeah, people. they're so nice and lovely. All right. So I think I think we I think we've gotten distracted far too much now. So I think it's about yeah, yeah. time we start. All right, cool. So um, we got now we're on the clock and yep. to do that. So yeah, all right. We'll go mute and we'll do. Uh, we'll do pizzeria stuff. stuff. Yeah, that that stuff. All right. Alrighty. Yeah. So well, I'll see you in an hour, week. Mister. All right. See ya, Mister. See ya. Bye bye. All right, guys. So the hour has begun. So um, yeah, it's time to work on our pizzeria. This dude is just standing right there. What's this? What's this dude doing? He's just he's just walking around. Okay. All right. All right. So yes, guys. Today's challenge is to build a Freddy Fazbear's location. So we we're building our own unique pizzeria, um, and we have an hour to build. And then at the end of this, we're gonna go um, and raid each other's builds and do a little tour at the end. Um, so if you guys want to go see Junkie build his pizzeria, uh, go check out his POV. It's on his channel, and uh, go subscribe to him too because he's a nice little little boy. So uh, yeah. Anyways, guys, I think it's time we get started. So something I didn't tell Junkie right there. Um, is that I got a secret. I got a secret. So earlier at the start of this, I said we were in version 1.1. And yes, it does fix the bed glitch, so now we can spawn out our beds. But that also means there's new stuff included in the mod. Um, and if you guys remember, in the last episode, I was able to find this FNAF 2 spawner in the jungle. So my plan is to spawn in the FNAF 2 location and uh, take the stuff from there. So, um... Yeah, so we're gonna, I'm gonna build, I'm gonna place down this FNAF 2 spawner, and then we're just gonna loot it, and then, um, and then, uh, yeah, so, uh, and also there's some new stuff that, there's, actually, no, there's a new person that spawns in the pizzeria, so, uh, yeah, there we go. Alright, so, uh, let's, uh, let's get started, shall we? Alright, so, actually, let me go ahead and tell y'all some of my plans, so, in the last episode, too, I did get a bunch of these pizzeria floor blocks, uh, so that will definitely come in handy in this episode. Uh, let's get some iron on us just in case. Um, let's see, we got these doors that will come in handy. Um, okay, and something else. Oh yes, the cassette player. So this will spawn in Henry, and you can tame him with a party hat. So as you guys know, Junkie has Purple Guy, aka Dave, in his house. So I was thinking about summoning uh, Henry in this new F FNAF location, and he can be like the cashier or whatever. Um, so. Uh, yeah, so first of all, we gotta figure out where we're gonna build our pizzeria, and I think I know where I'm gonna build it. I think I'm gonna build it right down there, um, cause you know, I think that'll be a nice and easy spot. Um, but I do need to place this FNAF 2 location down somewhere. So I guess first of all, let's go ahead and make an outline of the pizzeria. I think that's what we should do first. And we should probably make it out of, I guess we can make it out of dirt, shall we? Yeah, we'll make it out of dirt. And we have one diamond to our name. Where's my diamond? Um, ah, here it is. I think we're just gonna make a diamond shovel because everyone loves diamond shovels, right? So we're gonna make a diamond shovel. There we go. And um, we're gonna go make an outline. So, um, okay, let's see. Do I have any, um, I was wanting some more food, you know? Uh, okay, there we go, perfect. Okay, so uh, I'm thinking we go build it right here. Just right here on the corner, you know? So that way it's kind of close to our base. So we're gonna hop on over here and hopefully not die. So, all right, here we are. Should I build it right here? Um, it's, uh, oh gosh, yeah, Junkie's having a lot of fun over there. Um, so yeah, there's a lot of stuff added. <laughs> there's a, there's a good handful of stuff that's been updated in this mod. Oh yeah, what the heck? There is Pink Steve's. What the heck? I'm pretty sure they're, uh, they're Fazgoo's. Oh, they trade Fazgoo? Ooh, okay, so if you give them Fazgoo, oh, <gasps> you can get diamonds from them! Oh my gosh, yo, Steve, yo, my homeboy. Okay, so, uh, this is something new in the update. So there's these purple Steves, and, uh, if you give them Fazgoo, you get diamonds. Oh, okay, that is helpful. All right, we're definitely gonna need to trap one of these guys in A. Freddy's location. Okay, they just spawn all over the place. Do they all just trade the same thing? Because do they all offer, uh, offer diamonds? Oh, that's so helpful. Oh, thank you, add-on creator. Thank you. <laughs> Alright, so there's a bit of an easier way to get diamonds. So, uh, Alright, anyways, um, I think I should just go ahead and flatten out this entire area right here. So, uh, I think uh, let's just uh, let's just get started, shall we? Um, this guy's just kind of stalking me. Um, I... Okay then. 
Oh, he just got killed by Golden Freddy. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my gosh, he had it coming. He had it coming. I, I I don't know what he was up to. It seemed kind of mischief, you know? It seemed like he was up to no good. So uh, it's good that he got what he deserved. And there we go. The whole area is now flattened out some. Um, I have no idea if this mycelium is going to... Oh, it's probably not going to grow over because this is coarse dirt. Okay, well, we are going to be building over this right here. So, um, yeah, all right. So, what shall we do first? Um, okay, I think it, we're going to make an outline. So, now that we have all this flat land, uh, we're going to make a little outline here. Hello, Mr. Creeper. You aren't sus at all. Uh, yeah, be gone. Uh, hand unit comes in clutch. Um, okay, so let's do some strategy here. So, I want this face i want this right here to be like a bit of a back entrance to the pizzeria so that way i can get to my house act easy but over here should be like the front i think like right over here should be like the front entrance and stuff um so we'll have it so you walk in um you can say hi to henry right here junkies getting assassinated um but over here will be like the main sto show stage like right here then there'll be a back door that goes that way uh mr zombie get out of here um and then over here can be like a prize corner area so that is what i'm thinking for my pizzeria oh there's a fazgoo person okay oh so if you kill them you get fazgoo yo wait do if i trade this dude three fazgoo do i get three diamonds out of it yo purple steve yo homeboy so if i give him three i get three diamonds oh my gosh that is so helpful oh my gosh yo so we just need a you see it oh my there's a bunch of like fazgoo monsters in this forest Oh my gosh, and all the Steves like attack them too. Yo, I can just get infinite diamonds. Oh my, yo, okay, one version 1.1 is, oh my gosh, I like that so much. I can make a diamond chest plate. Oh my gosh, I'm just going to craft a diamond chest plate because why not? Oh my gosh, let's go. Oh, the Fazgu, that's so helpful. That's so helpful, it makes our life so much easier. Oh my gosh, oh, this is, after going through that diamond madness last time, oh, this is so much better. Oh, we also have 49, 49 minutes left. Okay, um, I need to make like a crafting table station. Oh, zombie, get out of here. Oh my gosh, that Fazgu is gonna come in handy. So whenever I see one of those Fazgu monsters, I just need to go and, uh, Go and kill them. Um, okay, I thought I saw something. Yeah, Junkie's junkies dying. Oh my gosh, bro. Rip Junkie. Um, you know what? I'll offer him help. <laughs> let's see. Do you need help? <laughs> oh no. Okay, let's uh, let's make a chest. Um, we're going to put this here. Um, okay, I guess let me... Uh, I guess let me go save Junkie really quick. Alright, so I just helped uh, Junkie um okay so while we're actually over here at the fnaf 2 location he's over here getting stuff so i think we should also take this opportunity to uh you know get some stuff too oh gosh golden freddy's down there oh god let's go ahead and kill him because that could be bad oh snap let's go i think we already have a jj wait no we don't have jj we have a uh, we have balloon boy we don't have jj okay nice we got another plushie sweet Okay, so we are going to, um, we're going to build into this place, um, because, yeah, Junkie is, like, looting this, uh, this building, so, uh, I think we're going to loot it as well. Let's take this endo, um, so, uh, yeah, what is this? It is silver concrete, okay, so, uh, let's just, uh, let's do some mining, shall we? Let's steal all these blocks. I think I have enough floor blocks, but I definitely do need some of these wall blocks, so uh, I guess let me uh, let me do some mining. Uh, uh, ah! Oh my god! I almost just got sniped by that bear water endo bindo. I gotta run! I gotta run! I gotta run! Oh my god! Oh! <laughs> god! Freaking dang it! <laughs> oh god! All right, so I think after going through all that pain, I think I got enough stuff. So uh, I am, uh, I'm heading out of here. Oh, and Nightmare On's down there. Oh, gosh. How? Okay, I don't think Nightmare On's following us. So, uh, all right. Well, after looting that place, that was, uh, that was a lot of pain. Um, I think I have enough blocks for now. I don't think I'll have enough blocks in total, but again, I do have my own custom FNAF 2 spawner because that right there is a FNAF 2 location, but is the broken FNAF 2 location. But I have a fully repaired FNAF 2 station right here, FNAF 2 spawner. 
Um, so uh, we need to summon that in. Because in this update, as well as you guys saw, there's the purple Steves and the Fazgoo people. Um, there's a good handful of small stuff that got added to the mod. And eventually there is going to be a version 2 of the mod where there's going to be a ton of new stuff as well. Which is already a ton of stuff in this mod, which is freaking nuts. Um, but yeah, a lot of stuff is getting added. And one thing that is also added is the Night Guard. So now every time there's a newly generated uh, FNAF location, a Night Guard will spawn with it. So uh, that's why I want to use this FNAF 2 spawner. Um, but, uh, yeah. Alright, so anyways, I think it's time we start construction on our new pizzeria. Oh my gosh, and Shadow Bonnie just has to be down here. Shadow Bonnie, why do you have to be down here, my guy? Oh gosh, don't teleport towards me. Oh gosh, okay, Shadow, oh, he's gonna wreck me. Um, okay, hey, Shadow Bonnie. Shadow Bonnie, can you hippity hoppity off my property? Oh, oh wait, he can't come here because of the rain. Where'd he go? Oh, he's up to there. Shadow Bonnie? Ah! Rain, save me! Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me, bro? Bro, I just want to build a pizzeria. Did he? Okay. Bro, can you, like, stay off of my property, please? That would, uh, that would be great. Yeah, hippity hoppity off of my property, okay? I'm. Oh god. Oh god. Stay. Go away. Yeah, that's right. Oh my freaking gosh. Okay, I think he's gone for good now. Um, I sure hope he is. If not, I'm going to scream. Okay, so we got our blocks. Um, let us see here. So, doop a doop a doop. Okay, so we're going to have a bit of a back entrance right here. So, uh, it should, uh, yeah, I'll be like one door. So, I think we go like something kind of like, oh wait, no, no, no. We, we need to raise it up by one so that way we can place the floor because the floor will be on top of these blocks, for example, right? So I have floor like that. And do I have some dirt in this chest that I can use as building blocks? That would be great. Okay, so we're gonna use this dirt as a bit of a building block. So I think right here should be the edge. And Junkie also got killed by Shadow Bonnie. Oh my gosh, Shadow Bonnie sniping people. Oh, did I just see Enderman particles? Oh my gosh, I think Shadow Bonnie is still, still nearby. I'm kinda, I'm kinda scared. Um, okay, so anyways, let's just continue building our pizzeria. Um, Alright, so, doop a doop a doop. Okay, so if we build a pizzeria floor like this, um, we now have 40 minutes. Um, so I want there to be a door right here. This is what I'm thinking. We have a back door right here. Um, this is like the back room. The back rooms, what? Oh no. So, okay, oh my gosh, that endo scared me right there. Holy frick. Oh, it's turning nighttime too. Oh, there's another Fazgoo monster. Okay, we gotta kill these. Because these are super freaking helpful. So we're gonna kill you. Oh my jeez! Jeez! I'm getting paid! Oh my god! I just got 20 Fazgoo! That is equal to 20 diamonds. Oh my oh my this these Fazgoo. Oh my gosh. I love this is a little too overpowered, but hey, I am not um I'm not complaining. Oh my gosh. Okay, we just got did I? Okay, I think I might have glitched some. Like, did I have 23 on me? I don't remember. Um, oh my gosh, there's more Fazgoo over here. Luckily, these guys just farm Fazgoo for you. Okay, uh, hopefully no one comes over here. One, two, three, four. Oh, okay, come on, come on, come on. Come on, before an animatron comes over here and kills me. Look at how many diamonds we got. <gasps> Bro, Bro, this was not my goal today to get diamonds, but yo, okay, we are we are set on diamonds. Let's go. Oh my gosh, that's so freaking helpful. Okay, so anyways, um, what shall we do now? So we should probably build our walls. So we're gonna have a wall like there. Um, let me uh, you know, I'm just gonna craft some diamond tools, don't mind me. Uh yeah, we're just gonna craft some tools. So uh so now we got an axe. And then now we got a diamond pickaxe. That is that is super helpful. Okay, and then uh, we got a diamond chest plate, so we're gonna make some diamond legs. We're gonna make a diamond helmet, and we're gonna make some diamond shoes. I love how we just got full diamond right there. Oh, that is that is good. That that is <laughs> that is so good. <laughs> god just after the last episode last episode we were trying to mine for diamonds and we failed horribly now i have full diamond armor oh my gosh okay that is super helpful because even still with full diamond armor these animatronics still do a bunch of damage so uh this helps out a little bit okay so let me think here so we can have um should it just be like this i think we're gonna have it like this and then this will go into the main 
room of the pizzeria. So we're gonna build it like here, uh, dupe a dupe, and then this right here will just be like an extra room for like storage or something. So there we go. I'll have to fix the outside later. So then like right here could be the stage. How wide should we do this? We should have it go like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I think like that, and then where's the, what should be the center block? So we could have like three, one, two, three, one, two, three. That could be the center of the state. Yeah, it's gonna be like a small stage. So uh, all right, that's gonna be the center. So this block right here, that's the center. So we gotta go one, two, three, four, five, at least five. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and it'll start going around like that. So uh, we'll just build it like this. And uh, there we go. And I think building it to like right here would actually be pretty good. So, yeah, we're gonna build this. Oh, look at this pizzeria. It's all coming together. Freddy Fazbear's is getting a new location today. And I think that's pretty good for the main area. So we can have the main area. Should I have a separate room for the prize corner? I think I am. So we'll have like the main area. Oh gosh, Fred Bear's right there. That's not good. Okay, so we'll do like the prize corner in like a separate room. We'll do that. And then, um, okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to get our dirt. We're going to build up with the walls. I'm going, oh, I'm going to have to go get more walls. Luckily, I got this FNAF 2 location in my back, in my back pocket. So we're going to have a door right here. This is going to go to like, should it be like right here or should it be like right in the center? I think it should be like right in the center. I think that would, that would probably look the best. All right. Yeah. So we'll have like a center walkway right here. And how big should this room be? It should probably be like one, two three blocks probably three blocks yeah we'll do three blocks and then it'll be like this we'll dig it out by one so this will be like the entrance um but right here we're gonna have we're gonna put henry right here so uh, we're gonna do this uh we're gonna do that and then little henry is going to sit in this little cubicle uh should it be like that big i mean yeah because it's gonna go like this so that's, this is like the layout for it. This is what I'm kind of thinking of. So if we got something like this, there we go. So we got our main entrance, we got our main dining room, and then we got our back room. So again, this is our first pizzeria. We are going to be making more locations um, as time goes on. Um, but as you guys can see, we're still in the starting phases. So this is our first location. So this is going to be very similar to like Fred Bears, for example. It's going to be a small location, have a small stage, um, but it's going to get the requirements. So uh, yeah. All right, so uh, let's see here. Um, okay, so we still need to do the price corner. Where should that be at? Should it just be like right here? Um, or should it be like an open room? I think we'll have it as an open room. So we'll have it like three, like right here. So it's like you walk in here and then you could go over here and then you can just have this huge prize area. I think this would be great. And then do you think this would be big enough? Because, I mean, we could stack the plushies. Uh, I don't know. Probably be maybe one bit bigger. I'm trying to think. I think that should be big enough. Yeah. So this will be our prize corner. I love how our prize corner is like slightly bigger than the actual main room. And then, um, do we need a back room? I mean, that's kind of the back room right there. Yeah. Okay. We'll just count that as the back room. And I think this will be it for our location. So it's our first location. It's kind of small. Um, also, I'm slowly running out of stuff. How much? Okay, yeah, see, all oh, this diamond armor. Oh, so helpful. It's so helpful to have diamond armor. Ooh, and more Fazgoo people. I will happily take you because uh, I'm sure we'll need lots of diamonds in the future. Okay, so bro, we're gonna kill you guys. Give me your Fazgoo. Give me your goo. Oh, we're getting infinite diamonds. Let's freaking go. Okay. Um, and then we also need to get Henry because you can actually trade with Henry too. So that'll be super helpful. So uh, let's just go ahead and fill in this floor really quick. Oh gosh, Fredbear! Fredbear! Oh! oh my gosh, I still don't feel safe going up against Fredbear. Wait, can I survive? How much damage does? Yeah, and that's with full diamond armor. So uh, yeah, I um, yeah, I don't think it's uh, fully overpowered. Oh gosh. Oh, he dropped Bonnie's guitar. Let's go. Got oh, Bonnie's guitar. All right, so, um, okay, where's my chest plate? Oh my gosh. So as you can see before I was interrupted by Fredbear, um, I don't have enough, uh, I don't have enough floor blocks. Um, so, uh, yeah, we're definitely gonna have to get 
a lot more blocks, but uh, we can go ahead and build up the wall some. Is this all the silver concrete I have on me? Or is there any more in here? Whoops. Uh, okay, good. There's another stack. And then we got this right here, which we can use as a desk. Um, so uh, I guess let me build up the walls by a layer. Oh, wait, I just remembered. We need to have a security office too. Oh, no. Okay, where, where would the security office go? Uh, where could we put a security office? Oh... Oh no, I didn't think about the security office. Oh gosh. I mean, I don't want to build it on this side because I mean, I could theoretically, but it's like, I don't want to, you know, I, um, all right. Yeah. We're gonna have to build a security office. Okay. So we can have, um, oh, how is this going to work? Oh, my brain, my brain, my brain, my brain, my brain. Okay. So we can have like a door right here. Um, and yeah, we're not doing any bathrooms, so we'll have like this. This can be like the security office, and then maybe we could have like a hallway, and that way we can get to like Henry from back here too, in the security office as well. So we could have like that, and then have a door right here. So we're gonna have a bit of like a hallway. Um, so yeah, we'll have like a hallway that goes to like right here, and then we can have a security office like right, um, right in here. So this will just be like, it goes like all the way to like right here. Cause then we will have a door right here. Um, doop a doop a doop, doop a doop a doop, -a -doop. What do we do? Um, oh gosh, the clock is ticking. Did I tell him? Oh yeah, we have a uh, we have 30 minutes left now. Um, oh my gosh. Okay, 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 okay. Um, t -t 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 shoot, that kind of threw off my plans. I completely forgot. We need to have a security office. Oh no. Okay. Um. All right. So this is what I'm kind of thinking. Um, for the security office so we have this and then we just have a hallway that goes down here and goes to Henry's room so uh, yeah I think um, I think that's uh, I think that's gonna be that um, okay so uh, we got to get to work uh, oh gosh I wish I had more tile blocks um I need to probably spawn in this FNAF 2 location where should I spawn it at that's the real question um I need to put it somewhere because I don't want junkie to get my goods but I want it to be nearby so we can uh, get the night guard over here because I think that would be really cool um, I have a lot of ideas, but we are limited to time. So, shoot. Okay, let's just go ahead and, uh, let me empty my inventory, and then we're gonna plop this location down somewhere. Um, oh my gosh, okay, uh, make another chest. Doop a doop, there we go. Okay, hurry, 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 plop it down. Uh, put that in there, put that in there for now. Uh, let's just empty our inventory. Uh, okay, there we go. Okay, that's, uh, that's, a. Uh, that's that's good enough okay we gotta hurry uh where should i put this i could put it underground oh there's the paper pals down there never mind um okay should i just like put it over i don't want it to look weird though so it needs to be like a place with like a bunch of flat ground um okay should i just do it like right here uh i don't i don't know if this is a good place uh let's just uh let's like um i think like right let's just do it like right here Okay, I think, I think it should be fine if we do it like right here. Okay, well, let's spawn in a FNAF 2 place. Oh gosh, there it is. Okay, yeah, that kind of, uh, that kind of broke some stuff. Oh god. <laughs> oh my god, this is the FNAF 2 location right here. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, that doesn't ruin, oh my gosh, it goes into the water, bro. Oh no, it's too big. <laughs> There's the FNAF 2 location right there. Okay, so uh, if we go inside here, um, we can get the plushies in here um, that we don't currently have. So uh, if we go in here, um, see, we got like everything. We got the box. We got a bunch of loot in here too. Um, so uh, we're going to loot this place. What plushies do I not have? I don't think I have... I don't have Toy Bonnie. And I don't have Mango. I think that's like... Yeah, that's the only two plushies in this place that I don't have. So uh, we're going to pick these two plushies up. Uh, we're going to pick up the music box. We can put that in our location. And then we're going to get all of these tables and chairs and move them on over. So, uh, yeah, we're just going to, uh, we're just going to loot this place. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Okay, let's pick everything up. Oh, gosh, the kitchen. Are we going to have a kitchen in our location? I don't think Junkie's going to make a kitchen. Um, I'm going to take this iron, though. I will happily take that. And I'll take one of these iron doors because uh, I'll need that. Um, I'll happily take those iron blocks. Um, should, uh, we should probably, uh, yeah, we'll take, uh, we'll take the furnaces too. Um, okay, what else do we, do we need? Um, okay, so we got more tile blocks. That's really good. 
What else do we need? We need, uh, do we need more wall blocks? I think we do. All right, um, let me just mine down these walls. <laughs> Oh, hey, look, it's the night guard. I love how he's completely fine with me destroying his pizzeria. So if you give him a fast coin, if you give him one of these, you can buy some of this stuff. Oh, we could get a go-kart. Oh, snap. And then you can buy a bunch of those uh, fizzy faz, and then you can buy a faz bag, I guess. Oh my gosh. So yeah, I want to try to get this guy in, um, in my location because we do not need him to die because that would be very bad because... Um, uh, yeah, because he only spawns at new pizzerias, and we would have to travel like a thousand blocks away. So, uh, luckily I had the spawner on me. So, I'm going to actually craft a boat, and um, I'm going to take him over. So, uh, yeah, all right, let's let's uh, let's make a boat. Uh, dupe a dupe. We are, the timer is starting to run kind of out. We're almost like, we almost have 20 minutes left. Um, so, uh, we got to speed this process up. And also, I need to come back here and get more blocks, too. All right, let's get, get this uh, new night guard on over to the new... Freddy Fazbear's location. We'll just break through this wall. That'll make it much faster. Yeah. Okay, actually, I guess this is kind of good that this does go off, like, into the water. So now we can steal this night guard. Oh, my we just kidnapped the night guard! <laughs> oh, my gosh. Okay, we'll have to, um... We'll have to get him inside in a minute. Oh, I didn't get more of the... Oh, my gosh. Okay, see, there's so much stuff we have to do. Also, I need to make sure an animatronic doesn't come by and kill the night guard, because I'm pretty sure the, night the animatronics will attack him. So, uh, we gotta be careful. Alright, let's go ahead and fill out the rest of this really quick. There we go. Uh, yeah, we'll just replace this. I'm going to need more floor blocks, too. Oh my gosh. I need more of everything. Um, and then that's it. That's all I have. Okay, let me empty my inventory. And let me go do some more looting. Oh, the spring bonnie suit. Oh, we gotta get this. We gotta put this in the location. Oh, that's gonna make Junkie jealous. I'm going to take these candies, too. Oh, let's go. All right. I think that should be enough stuff for now. We have a little under 20 minutes left. I got to get back because I got to make sure an animatronic doesn't kill the night guard. Um, okay. He's still safe and sound. Yeah. I got to make sure he's protected. So we're going to actually drag him out into the, into the middle of the ocean. Uh, that doesn't sound like a safe place, but it is safe from animatronics. So uh, we're going to put him right there just in case if an animatronic comes by. So uh, we have to keep an eye on him. But we should have enough blocks now to finish off this location. So, uh, yeah, okay, let's see here. We're going to uh, fill this in right through here. Uh, we need the walls. Uh, dupe a dupe. We're going to put in the floor right here. There we go. Look at this. All nice and cozy. Look at this location. This is the best Freddy's location. Guys, would you come eat at this Freddy's location? You better say yes. All right, there we go. The frame of the location is is now done um okay so now we just got to put everything inside and we also have to put torches everywhere so uh let's go ahead and put some torches in uh we're gonna have our front desk be like right here so this is where henry's gonna be henry's gonna sit right there at the front desk and we got to make sure he can't escape so we got to put some uh some blocks overhead i don't have enough silver concrete bro <gasps> oh my gosh bro we are like limited to blocks okay um okay so we need the tables we need, uh, what did I just get? The puppets box. So we're going to put the puppets box in the prize corner area. Uh, not right there. Oh God. It's so hard to see everything. Okay. Uh, right. No. Put it like right there. There we go. Puppets box right there in the corner. That looks lovely. Uh, we're going to put these torches, um, around the place. Oh gosh. Okay. So we'll put that there. We'll put that there. We'll put that there because we got to brighten up this location. Um, okay, so then we'll have a torch in here, I guess. Um, and then we'll have a torch right here and here. We're going to have another table. Oh, I don't have any more table blocks. Oh my gosh, and there's so many animatronics. Mr. Nightguard! Nightguard's like, please help me. <laughs> and I got to make sure the Nightguard stays safe too. So, and now it's raining. God dang it. Okay, Nightguard, you doing good? You doing all nice and cozy? Okay, um, I'm, uh, I can't focus. Okay, so we gotta have our tables. Oh, we have to build the stage too. Okay, we're just gonna make it out of dark oak because that's all I have. So, yeah, right here's the middle block. One, two, one, two, one, two. Uh, and then we can have it like this. Should we have stairs or... Oh, wait, we can make slabs. That would be, that would probably be a bit better. So, let's make some of these slabs. Um... Oh gosh. Okay, there's a purple monster. 
Okay, Night Guard's fine. I hear Balloon Boy laughing. Balloon Boy, now is not the time. Okay, what was I doing? I was making uh, these in the slabs. Oh gosh, there's JJ. Get out of here, JJ. Okay, um, let's do this. Because I think, yeah, this makes it look a bit better. There we go. And then we can do a torch right there. We can do a torch right there. Hey, and yo. Then a torch right there. Oh gosh. Hello? Hello, um, yeah, so, uh, change of plans, I actually have to kind of dip right now, unfortunately. No! Um, yeah, I, I know, we were, we were so close to being done. Alright guys, so you heard it right there, unfortunately, Junkie had to go, which that's completely fine, that happens sometimes. Um, but we both agreed that we would finish our pizzerias in our own time, and I'm gonna go ahead and continue working on my pizzeria right here, right now. So, uh, we're gonna finish up our pizzeria, and, um, in the next episode, at the start of the next episode, we agreed that we will do our tour then. Um, so we'll get to see what Junkie's, uh, pizzeria looks like at the beginning of the next episode. But if you guys want to see his pizzeria a little earlier, he's, he should have uploaded his part right by now on YouTube. So, uh, go over to his channel and check it out if you want to sneak peek at what, what, what Junkie's been up to. So, uh, yeah, but anyways, we're gonna go ahead and continue, um, and, uh, finish off the pizzeria. So, um, alright, let's go ahead and finish this off okay so what do we have left to do we got to put henry in there um and then we got to put shelves in this room because i want this to be you know a plushy room right so where are the plushies going to go where should they all go we could have should we put something there we could do like um something else i want to do is like these shelves kind of thing so it's like we have uh i'm pretty sure yeah you build it like uh like this yeah i think this looks kind of cool so i think we should put like one of those right there and put like another one of these shelves in like the security office too um whenever we work on that or yeah, yeah screw it we'll just put a shelf right here there we go add in some decorations so uh there we go we got a nice little shelf um so uh yeah okay so what we need to do now is we need to build this so we can oh we're only gonna be able to because of the size of this place we're only gonna be able to have like one thing of plushies Unless we do, like, some on the floor, which that would look kind of strange. And then we build some up higher, like that. That, that would, that, that's going to look weird, isn't it? Oh, gosh. Okay. Um, how are we going to do this? So, uh, alright, so we can, uh, we can just do it like, we'll do it like a table, like right here. So, we have, like, boom, that's enough for, like, six plushies right there. And then I guess we can do something like along like right here. I guess we'll just make it like a giant table that goes like kind of like all the way around like that. So I think that looks kind of good. Yeah, there you go. I think that should uh that should work out pretty smooth. So uh, that's where we will start storing our plushies from now on. And that way we can be right here in a nice collection. We might actually have to move this shelf um, to get more supplies. Um, or we could do... Oh, wait, we could do... um. We could do like a row in the center. Oh, that would look kind of cool. Like do like a table in the center and put plushies on it. Okay, that's actually not that bad of an idea. Um, okay, so I guess we should go ahead and start figuring out how we're going to do this. So that's one table. Do I want it right there? Um, how? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. No, we can't have that right there. Okay, so we got to... No. Okay, we're going to have the table like right there. And then we'll have one. No, not there. These tables are really hard to place. Okay. And we'll have one right here. How does that look? I think that looks kind of good. Um, oh, wait, we need to put... Oh, uh, we can't put them there because we need to put... Uh, we need to put chairs. So we need to go have, leave a space right there. And then we're going to... Uh, what if we flipped it around? So that way the party hats are a bit different. I think I'm going to do that. Yeah, there we go. That way the party hats get flipped up a bit. So, um... Uh, we're gonna have to bring it this way. What <laughs> the struggles of placing tables in Minecraft? Okay, so we're gonna put it there. We're gonna move move it back a block away from the stage. And unfortunately, we're not we don't have an animatronic yet, so uh, we're just gonna have the suit in the back room. Um, so this will just go like back here somewhere, which I I don't know yet. So okay, but that's what I'm thinking of. So uh, we got our chair. So uh, let's go ahead and just place place these chairs down um okay we're not gonna put them on that side because that looks weird um should we just have like two chairs or and we got a bunch of chairs we'll do like three chairs at a table because yeah this is a a bit of a small location so uh all right there we go we got that i think that looks pretty good um we got a front desk is our night guard guy still okay yep he's still in the water he's having a blast it's gonna take forever to get him in here 
Um, okay, and then we're gonna have our iron door. So we're gonna put the iron door right here so that way Henry can't escape. And we'll put a block right there. Um, so uh, there we go. And we're not gonna put a button or anything right there because we don't want we don't want our boy Henry getting out, but we gotta show that he can get out if he wants. And then we'll put a chair right there too. So uh, there we go. And then should we put anything else in this room? We could put a chest. I think that would look kind of cool. Okay, let's put a chest in there. That might look all nice and uh, nice and cozy. So we'll put we'll put a little chest in here. There we go. So it's like, hey, bro, can I get can I get the monies, please? So uh, yeah. So uh, you can deposit your FAS tokens in there. And um, I think that's pretty good. Is there anything else we need to do? Um, I mean, obviously, yeah, we don't have a roof yet. I have no idea what I'm going to make the roof out of. I'm going to worry about that last. So this is how tall the place is going to be. It's going to be three blocks tall. we got to figure out what we're doing for the security office. So we'll have like a chair here. And then should we just put like the night guard? Where should we put the night guard? Because I want to put him somewhere. Okay, we're going to put... I think we're going to put the chair like right here. Or actually here, let's just put, we'll put like a chair like right there in the corner, you know, just a nice little chair. Um, and then we can have like, we'll put like a mini desk or something in the corner. Okay, let me go get some more, let me go get some more blocks. All right, so uh, let me go get some more supplies. And I got some loot. So let's figure this out. I want to build like a desk, kind of similar to like to where Henry is, but we got to trap the night guard inside so he can't escape. So how shall we do this? We could do it like, I mean, we could just build it like this, you know, like have it like that. We could just do that. Should we just have it like that? Um, or we could do it like, like this kind of, and then uh, we could, let's move, we're going to move the shelf on second thought. We'll just have like a giant freaking desk right here. Okay. And then, um, so it's like, Hey, you come in here, you got Mr. Night Guard. He's vibing. He's chilling. Uh, I just don't like how small this room is. Okay, we're gonna actually have it like this. There we go. Uh, and then we'll put a chair like right here. And then we could have like a locker somewhere, like right there. Uh, we're gonna put that, um, whatchamacallit, this thing like right back right here. So there we go. Nice little shelf in here. So there we go. This is where the night guard's going to be at. He's just gonna be vibing in there. We'll have, we'll give him two lockers. Um, actually, now that that looks kind of weird, so we're gonna actually take that locker away. So he's just gonna be vibing in here, and uh, we could we could put him like right here. Yeah, if we could put him like right here, and, and then we could put like a lantern or something on the ceiling, like right there, so that way he can't escape. Oh, but it's not in the center block. I want it to be in the center block, uh, but that way he can get trapped right there. So I think that's what we're going going to do. Um, I think that's everything I'm gonna do in that room. Um, okay, what else is there that we need to do? Oh, wait, we have these TVs. I forgot. So I got these TVs from the location as well. So uh, should we, uh, how should we do this? We could have like, we could just put these like right there. I think that would look kind of cool. Yeah, it fills in, fill in, in the void a little bit. Um, there we go. Which we could slide the desk over a block. Should we slide the desk over a block? Eh. I mean, actually, yeah, let's do that. Because if he's going to be right there, then he can't like, um... Oh, whoops, that's the one block I need. But yeah, if he's in the corner, then he can't, um, he can't escape. So, uh, we'll do it like, we'll have it like this. And then, uh, we'll still, we'll have the TVs like that. So it's like he comes in, and boom. So, uh, the night guard's gonna be trapped right here. So, uh, and that way we can come up to him and trade. Alright, and so for the back room, this is what I'm kind of thinking of. We put our, we gotta get our spring bonnie suit right back here. We got these other two lockers right here. I think that looks pretty good. And then we could put some endo bindos um, back here too. So uh, I think that looks pretty good. Even though we have no animatronics in this place, <laughs> um, I still think that looks pretty good. So uh, I think that is going to be our, um, I think that's going to be our location. Mr. Nightguard is sad. He's just out there in the rain. He's like, please let me inside. Shadow Freddy, what are you doing, my guy? Oh my gosh. Okay. And he's dead. Nice. Wait, what is this? Oh, agony. Okay. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we're going to put that up. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. All right. So I just grabbed a handful of my plushies, and we're going to go ahead and start putting these in the prize corner area because for, for the time being, this is where we are going to start storing all of our plushies 
Um, so, uh, yeah. Also, I do think we are going to be doing another plushie hunt in the next episode. So, if you guys want to see that happen for the next episode, make sure to leave a like. Because, you know, that's always that's always helpful and stuff. So, um, yeah. Alright, so we got a handful of these plushies. I have no idea where I'm going to put these. Um, okay, where should we put them? We could have, like... Okay, we'll do it in order. So, here, we'll put those on the floor right now. Because I'm pretty sure I have Toy Bonnie and Mangle over in this chest. Uh, yes, they are. Um, okay, there we go. Alright, so, uh, we're gonna do this in order. So, we got a Toy Freddy plushie, we got Toy Bonnie, uh, where's Toy Chica? Oh, here she is, we got Toy Chica, then we got Mangle, um, then we got Balloon Boy, and then we're gonna, we'll put Dee Dee in the corner? Uh, should we, should we put Dee Dee in the corner? Oh, but that, the Dee Dee's gonna look like that, though. Oh, I don't think that's gonna work. I don't have a lot of room in here. Um, I'm gonna put... We'll put Lemonade Clown right there, and then Fruit Punch Clown right there. There we go. They're all nice and cozy in here. Um, and then we got the Exotic Butters. Oh, we could put the Butters in the corner. That would actually look... That would probably look better. Yeah, Exotic Butters right there. Um, got Dee Dee. And then we got the Shadow Plushies. We got Fredbear. We have all these Golden Freddy Plushies, too. Um, oh my gosh. There's a lot. Okay, where are we putting these ones? Should we just do it like here? Like, do Fredbear? Um, I have no idea what we're gonna put in the corner right there. We'll figure something out. Um, we could do a black concrete for now, I guess. I don't know. And then just put the phone right there. Um, okay, so let me think, let me think, let me think, do think. Um, it would actually probably look better if I had another dark oak block, which I don't know if I do. I think it would be in this chest somewhere. Uh, do I have another dark oak wood? Yes, I do. Okay. Uh, yeah, I just, uh, I just got killed by the night guard. So, it's been a little while, hasn't it? So, I was doing some stuffs. I was trying to get the night guard inside, and I accidentally punched him. And I think he's, is he still mad at me? We friends? We homies? Yeah, I accidentally hit him. I'm so sorry. I did not mean to hit you. Oh, gosh. Um, yeah, I just got, a, I got killed by this guy. Okay, you want to go inside? That would be great. Can you, can you go inside? Please, like, go, go inside. No, 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 uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, okay, go, 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 go on, go on, go on, go on, no, this way, this way, pal, come on, oh, he can still go down, uh, okay, there we go, come on, inside the security office, come on, don't you want to go inside, oh, let's go security officer there we go he is inside so we're gonna block this up do i i of course i don't have the right blocks on me uh no gimme 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 let's go mr nightguard is safe and sound in his new security office so hello there mr nightguard so uh yeah so he can't escape right here he's trapped inside um because of this lantern so he can't jump out and uh, this is considered two blocks, so uh, yeah, he's trapped inside. And now we can trade with him right here nice and easily. So, uh, welcome Mr. Security Guard to your home forever. There's no escape. All right, guys, so now that we have the night guard inside of his security office, I think it's about time that we try to get Henry into his little position right here. So uh, this is all set up. So uh, again, the lantern prevents him from uh, jumping out. So uh, we just got to, you know, figure out what to do here. Also, I hear a foxy. It's probably fine. So I'm sure if we summon, I, so we have the cassette player. So this should summon him. Boom, there he is. And uh, so, yeah, this is Henry. And if we give him a party hat now, uh, if he's, I don't know why he's in the chair. But as you guys can see, he now trades. So uh, you can get, uh, you can get Fredbear, you can get a present. And also you could get Fazer Blasters from him. So uh, yeah, this is where we're going to keep him. Also, I think I hear a wandering trader. Um, let's go investigate. I think I hear him out. Oh, it's turning nighttime. Um, is there a wandering trader? I hear llamas. What? Ah, oh, there he is. Hello, wandering trader. Um, oh, yeah, you have a, you have nothing useful. But the one thing you do have that's useful is, um, leads. So, uh, hippity hoppity. Give me, give me your property. Give me your property, pal. All right, hand over the leads. All right, hand over the leads and no one gets hurt. Okay, I got a knife. Yeah, that's right. I got you. I got you in the corner. What? I got you cornered. What you gonna do? Hey, no running. No, ah, no running. No. Oh my God. Oh, oh hey, free leads. <laughs> now I can have a pet Fazgu Steve. Yo, I can get pet Fazgu people. <gasps> Should I bring one inside? Oh my gosh. I don't know where I would put him though. I have like no space in here anymore. Um, 
like every corner is kind of taken up um so this is good that we have leads okay this is really good um we could put him in the corner over here <laughs> I kidnapped, I kidnapped Goo Steve. Bro, I was like, I'm putting him on... St oh, I could put him on the stage. <gasps> I was originally going to have Egg Baby on stage, but should I should I put Faz Goo Steve on stage? Oh, that might actually look kind of cool. Originally, I was just going to leave Egg Baby on the stage, but I think it might be more funnier with Faz Goo Steve. Oh, yes. let's. She's going to be our animatronic. <gasps> oh, my gosh. Let's get him on the stage. Oh, my gosh. That is perfect. <laughs> Guys, Faz Goo Steve is ready to perform. Oh my god, we just kidnapped Faz Goo Steve and we just put him on the stage. Oh, look at this dude. Oh, that's perfect. Yo, I'm about to get paid. Oh my gosh. So I kidnapped this dude, but in return, I'm gonna give him some Faz Goo. So uh, I can just give him all this Faz Goo for, uh, for diamonds. Oh my gosh, this is... <laughs> I now have 51 diamonds. Oh my gosh, that is so freaking helpful. I love you, Mr. Fazgoo Steve. You are the best edition of version 1.1, I have to say, my guy. Wait, what Bonnie is- I've never seen that Bonnie before. Who are you? Oh, I think that's like- Oh, I think that was like Help Wanted Bonnie. I think that was like the Repair Bonnie or whatever. Oh god, the Fazgoo Steves have multiplied. Oh, why- why are there so many Fazgoo Steves? Guys, the Fazgoo Steves are slowly taking over. I'm I'm kind of scared. <laughs> yes. The time has come. The time has come. <laughs> I will be powerful. <laughs> Efficiency, efficiency, and then, ooh, what if I, what if I go over here and uh, what if I use my crafting bench since I have a bunch of diamonds now? Uh, I could, uh, I could do this one in <gasps> efficiency. Uh, uh, oh no! And then they fell in the anvil and, uh, oh my, oh my gosh! It's an efficiency two diamond pickaxe. <laughs> All right, let's see how much faster this bad boy is. Ooh, okay, speeding it up, speeding it up. So, uh, yeah, as you guys can see, I am still demolishing this FNAF 2 location. Oh, hello, Mr. Skeleton. Oh, no, hello, Mr. Skeleton. So, you're probably wondering, X-Man, why are you destroying the FNAF 2 location? I think you're doing a lot more stuff while, uh, while Junkie's gone. And yes, you would be right. But the reason why I am destroying this is because I don't like I don't like where this FNAF 2 location is spawned at. And eventually later on in the future, we are going to be making even bigger pizzerias. So might as well go ahead and uh, break this down because I know eventually I'm going to destroy it. So might as well just destroy the whole thing right now. Gather the resources, put them in a chest. And um, yeah, so my pizzeria is done. So I am kind of done working on it. I only have to do like a few touches on the outside. But don't worry, guys. Don't worry. If you're afraid that Junkie's going to get left behind, don't worry, guys. I'm going to give him lots and lots of time to catch up um and also if you're wondering about the enchantment table um i want to enchant my stuff so that way i can mine this a bit faster and get efficiency on it and stuff because this is this is taking forever i've been here for a couple hours and uh i, I want to cry this is only how much i've i've destroyed but uh in the future it will be so much better to be able to use these resources uh for future builds and stuff so i was like hey let's go ahead and do all the mining right now so that way in the future whenever we have a build challenge we already have all the blocks and we don't have to worry about gathering resources all right, well, uh, wish me luck in destroying the rest of this. Oh my gosh, this is taking forever. Hey, yo, what the heck? There's another wandering trader over there. Yo, Mr. Wandering Trader, what up, my homie? You got anything good? Got anything that I can spare your life for? What's up, my boy? You're, you're, j this is a joke, right? <laughs> it's a... Hippity hoppity, your leads are now my property. Yeah, that's right. Give me the leads. Ah! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Llamas. Die. 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 Die, fools. Oh my gosh. They're spitting on me. Bro. You know, something I just realized is that the, uh, the mod maker had to build these locations and then set them up. So, uh, I, I wonder, I wonder how the mod maker feels about me destroying an entire FNAF 2 location. Um, um, I mean, it's a great build, but it's also, it's also got a great amount of resources in it. Oh my god. Ah, my pickaxe, bro. Holy frick, I've spent an entire Minecraft day mining this roof, and I'm only halfway done. This is gonna take forever. Oh my 
gosh, holy frick, even with efficiency too. And there goes my diamond pickaxe, bro. Also, yeah, there's a creeper down there. Oh my gosh, but I am destroying this location block by block. I have no idea if Junkie even saw that I placed down this location. <laughs> oh my gosh, I, I have no idea. Holy frick. All right, well, it's time to pick up all these blocks. And yeah, there's a bunch of mobs spawning down here. Um, I'm trying to leave the redstone lamps for last. So that way, you know, no spookum spawn down here. But, but I keep having all these dang creepers. So, uh, yeah. Well, at least on the bright side of having a bunch of diamonds is uh, I can easily just make another pickaxe. Yay. And we're going to get efficiency two on it again. Um, yeah, efficiency. And then we're going to get another efficiency. Wait, what? No. No. Uh, um, but that's all my levels. Uh, how am I supposed to combine? I don't have enough levels. Oh, wait, I can just go down here and uh, kill some squids. All right, come on, squids. Give me that XP. Give me those. Wait, do they even drop XP? Bro, squids? You drop XP? Bro. What do you mean? Oh, wait, they do drop XP. Okay, for some reason, I thought they didn't. I was like, what the heck? Are they not dropping any XP? Oh, uh, let me get some XP. All right, so after killing an entire family of fish, I think I have enough levels. There we go. And while we're here, should we... Can I enchant my chest plate? Uh... No, ew, I don't want that. I can enchant my pants, maybe? I don't want that. I want regular protection. Okay, maybe I should just enchant an axe then. Uh, efficiency, efficiency, and efficiency. Of course, it's always just efficiency. Um, okay, there we go. We'll get efficiency on the axe. Uh, should I make it efficiency too? Or should I just get... I'm breaking. What do you mean just unbreaking? Bruh, okay, let me... Uh... Alright, we'll get efficiency on another axe too and we can combine them as well um what that's also unbreak are you kidding me i don't want unbreaking all right you know what i hate you mr enchantment table yeah holy frig this place is just abandoned yo i feel like this is what like finance freddy's 2 probably looked like like after it like got closed down and stuff like this is this is the definition of like a, an abandoned fnaf 2 location all the walls are like ripped down and stuff holy frick <laughs> i just can't believe i've mined this much holy frick and yes i have been here for quite a few hours and uh, as you guys can see there's still at least half of a pizzeria to go oh, oh my gosh holy frick oh you gotta be kidding me golden freddy's now on there bruh golden freddy what are you doing oh my gosh well now it's time for diamond pickaxe number three or oh, actually technically this is diamond pickaxe number four my first one wasn't enchanted and then it broke uh, all right, time to make another another diamond. Pick <gasps> oh my god! Holy frick! <gasps> what the heck is Burn Trap doing in my house? Burn Trap! Oh, gosh, that just scared me. Okay, um, you. Oh gosh. Okay, I got is a fish to eat. Can you go away? Is who else is in there? Is that Toy Freddy? Why are these animatronics in my house? Bro, get out of my house! I already have a Toy Freddy plushie, but thank you, Mr. Toy Freddy. I appreciate it. Um, oh my gosh. Holy frick, what are all these people doing in my freaking house? Do I have no pizza? I have no pizza. I ate all my things of candy. Um, I have a stack of soda. Okay, I guess I'll just have some soda from now on. Um, okay, what was I doing before I just got freaking jumped? Um, I need to make another pickaxe. Oh my gosh, this is so expensive out of diamonds, but luckily we have those fast goo people, so we have infinite diamonds. Um, so there isn't much to worry about. Okay, what? I need lapis. Wish, wish me lapis. Okay, all right, come on. Why? Why? Can you give me better stuff? Okay, efficiency one. Yes. Oh, this. Oh wait, efficiency one and unbreaking. I'll take that. I would take that. Yoink! Just the right amount of levels. Okay, perfect. Oh my gosh, Golden Freddy, bro, this dude is stalking me. Oh my gosh. Okay, Golden Freddy. Hey, hey. Oh, oh, he's upset. He's upset because I just broke his home. That's right. This is withered Golden Freddy. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yeah, he's up. He's upset because I I vandalized his house, bro. I'm sorry, Golden Freddy. I. Where'd he go? But I I'm sorry, Golden Freddy. I, I needed the blocks, okay? I, I needed the resource, my home dog. I'm kind of scared. Oh, I think he's above me. Um, Golden Freddy. Uh, 
gonna put that there. I don't like this at all. Um, okay. This is not a bad idea. This is not a bad idea. Go in the water. Where is he? Golden Freddy. Golden Freddy. Gosh, he's so freaking creepy. Okay, I think Golden Freddy's gone. Oh, yeah. Okay, Golden Freddy's gone. Oh my gosh, that dude was angry. I mean, I guess I'd be angry too if somebody came along and destroyed my house. Oh my goody goodness, there's another wandering trader, bro. Alright, you got something good? Well, I think we all know what's about to happen. Give me them leads! Give me them leads! Give me them leady leady leads! Oh my god. Gosh, okay. Yep, two new leads. Oh, I'm so close to being done with this. Bruh, you gotta be kidding me. My axe is about to break, so I was like, hey, I'm making new diamond axe. I forgot I made one earlier, so, uh, oh well. I mean, we got infinite diamonds, so it doesn't matter. Okay, time to make another axe. Where's my lapis? Okay, come on, levelers. Come on, come on, come on. Give me something good. Give me something. No, not diamonds. We're not enchanting diamond. Come on, give me that efficiency. Let's go. And then now, I can combine these. What, level four? Hey, level two. Okay, that's more like it. <sighs> Alright, the time has finally come. This journey was really freaking long. And when I mean really freaking long, I mean really freaking long. So, me and Junkie, we started this recording session at five. And uh, Junkie had to get off, as you guys know. And I decided to keep on playing. I was like, hey, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and break down this building. You know, it won't take that long. Uh, yeah, it's now 11. I've been playing Minecraft for six hours now. And it has paid off. It is gone. The FNAF 2 location is completely gone. I destroyed the entire thing. That took so freaking long. And this is all that's left is the main door. So I want to break the final blocks on a camera that FNAF 2 location is gone originally I was thinking about leaving it but once I spawned it in I was like holy freak this is so much bigger than I thought it was and it did not fit on that tiny little island so uh yeah but it had to had to get destroyed um but uh, hey we got all the resources from it so uh, I say it's pretty much worth it oh my freaking god this took forever I'm definitely not breaking down another pizzeria in this series for a good freaking while that took so long but this will be so helpful for future episodes um so yeah i got these chests just filled with materials gathered from the pizzeria oh my gosh look at all this stuff holy frick there's so freaking much oh my gosh and this isn't even all of it i put some of it in my house and i've also put some of it in the those chests over there next to my pizzeria oh my gosh holy frick it's so weird now that that it's gone it was like it was here and then it was gone oh my freaking gosh that that took forever now there's one thing left for me to do i have to move all this stuff to somewhere else wait what happens if i if i uh Oh, okay, they don't, they don't do anything. Did they fight back? Oh, yes, they do. Yeah, they fight back. Oh, gosh. Okay. Oh, gosh. All right, guys. So there is one thing our pizzeria is missing. The final touch, the final detail to add a sign. All right, guys, for the name of my pizzeria, I have decided to name it Gooey Drinks. Yes, guys, that is right. So uh, the reason why we're calling it Gooey Drinks is because there is a, uh, there's no kitchen um, and, uh, we got a Gooey Steve in here as the main mascot, so, uh, this Gooey Steve here is gonna entertain the kids with his weird fazgoo. Um, and, uh, the reason why it's drinks is because if you come over here to the night guard, he sells fizzy faz. So, uh, yeah, there you go. All right, guys, so I don't think I've taken you guys on a tour of my pizzeria fully finished. So, uh, yeah, this is the pizzeria from the outside, you know, not really pleasing on the outside. But, hey, you know what, that's uh, okay. You know, it's just a nice, simple pizzeria. Um, so, uh, yeah, uh, we got two doors because, uh, 
I'm fancy. So, uh, yeah. So, uh, let's go inside. Um, so, yeah. So, here's the main entrance right here. We got our boy Henry. We got a chest that has absolutely nothing in it. We got a Fredbear plush right there just for a fun little decoration. Um, and that iron door cannot be opened up. It's just for little decoration and stuff because we don't want Henry to escape. Um, but here you can buy some stuff from him. So, uh, there we go. We're definitely going to have to buy some stuff from him later on. But he's also got these monitors right here. So, he's just watching some, I don't know, gaming videos or something. Um, but we got a nice little egg baby to make sure you don't steal anything. Um, and then you got some waiting chairs right here so you can sit here and wait uh if, just in case if the tables are full anyways if you go into the main room you got fruit punch clown you got lemonade clown and you got the all the party tables and stuff right here so you can come in here and have a birthday party here with uh and and, and watch uh uh watch gooey steve stare into your soul yeah gooey, that's all gooey steve does he just stares at you dang why is he hot oh yeah and then also we have a shelf because uh why not you know to fill in the fill in the empty space um so uh, yeah so over here is the prize corner so this is all the plushies i have collected so far and uh yeah i um i kind of wish i would have I, I wish i would have made this prize corner bigger because um i have way too many plushies and uh, i think we're gonna try to get more in the next episode so uh that, that that's a problem for episode six x-man 723 yeah that's a problem for him but at least we got all of our plushies um in here and stuff so i try to make them nice and orderly so we have i think we have all the fnaf 2 plushies um so yeah so we have like fnaf 2 right here so we have toy freddy toy bonnie toy chica mangle balloon boy we got the exotic butters up there we got jj we have plush trap scrap trap spring trap shadow bonnie shadow freddy golden freddy Haunted Fredbear, Spring Bonnie, Fredbear, and then the Puppet. We also got the phone up there. Um, then we got Old Man Consequences, Nightmare Balloon Boy, Nightmare Puppet, uh, Dee Dee. We got the one and only Freddy Fazbear himself. We got Helpy, and then we got Nightmare. And we also got the Puppets box in the corner as well. And then over here, we have this special shelf, because this is the Waifu shelf. All right, this is all the Waifu plushies. We got Waifu Ballora. Mm, Waifu Ballora. Uh, we got Scrap Scrap Baby. We got Vinny. And then we got Nightmare Mangle. Um, in all honesty, I, I would switch nightmare mingle out for a uh, toy chica but i leave i'm leaving toy chica right here so it fits in with the fnaf 2 vibes um but uh i mean she's kind of hot though <coughs> anyways moving along now um so over here we got the hallway this is a nice hallway um so right here you can sneak on henry like hey bro he's like please let me out of here please i haven't seen my wife in 10 years uh yeah no you have to stay there um so uh, yeah but if we go on over here we have the security office which can also be accessed through this door right here so we got a nice another shelf we got the phone right there so we can pick up the phone uh we got a locker in there and again none, none of these lockers have anything it's just for decoration and the security guard is trapped right here so uh, you can come with the security guard man and uh get some stuff you got the employee starter pack you got some fizzy fast and then you got a race car so uh yeah i think he's pretty pretty cool um so then if we go into this room right here this is the backstage area um so this is where you would put on your spring bonnie suit or your employee stuff again these lockers are also empty and uh, we got a puppet plushie and another phone plushie back here just for a nice little decoration to fill in the void we got a bunch of endo bendos here i love how there's endo skeletons back here yet we don't have an animatronic on stage it's just this dude bro where's your spring bonnie costume at my guy yeah we just, we just have indos back here oh my gosh but it's very nice decorative and uh yeah that's um that's pretty much it for uh for for gooey drinks that's uh that's the pizzeria i built or the drinkeria i guess so all they sell here is fizzy faz but i mean you could get a, a, an infinite amount of fredbear plushies if you want so um yeah there you guys go that is my pizzeria so uh yeah so anyways guys we're gonna have to wait until the next episode to see what junkie crafts um so again since junkie did have to go during this episode um he's gonna come back on later and finish up his pizzeria and then we're gonna get to see what it looks like in its fully finished form which oh you can take a you can see a little sneak peek back there yeah there's a little sneak peek um I did, uh, I did, I did wander over there and it's, it's looking a little, I'm not gonna lie, it's looking a little rough right now in its current state, um, but hopefully Junkie can come on and uh, finish the, his pizzeria, I'm gonna give him as much time as he possibly wants, uh, since, uh, since I spent a good time on my pizzeria, uh, more time than we allowed, because originally we were like, oh, we're gonna have one hour to build our pizzeria, yeah, that was a mistake, I think, I think we're gonna try starting doing it from, like, this point from now on for, like, these build-in challenges at least, um, instead of doing, like, a timer, like, we can do it in our own time and stuff, because I, I I enjoyed it much more doing it in our own time without having like the rush like oh my god we have one hour i gotta make it look good you know so I, th I thought this was a nice more peaceful approach um so i think we're gonna try doing this from now on with all the building challenges and stuff so that way we can actually build bigger builds and stuff like that so uh yeah
all right so anyways guys that is the end of part five so uh, yeah this was a really long episode so i hope you guys did enjoy it oh you can see my house up there oh that's nice that is nice right there so uh, yeah so anyways guys i hope you guys did enjoy this episode thank you guys so much for all the support on the series too it means so much to me that you guys are enjoying the series um so uh, yeah again also feel free to check out fnaf junkies pov his channel is linked in the description below so uh go check out uh his channel and stuff because uh, i'm sure his video is uploaded right now so if you guys want to see what his pizzeria looks like go check it out on his channel so uh yeah but anyways guys that's gonna be it for today so i hope you guys did enjoy and i will see you guys in part six or, or i guess in my video tomorrow um yeah uh, anyways yeah. <laughs>